Uh, good day, smart farmers. Uh, this is Masimbo Ngevuma from Sahapa Projects. Uh, so today we are going to discuss uh, broiler production. Uh, for those of you who are interested uh, into venturing into broiler production, just want to give you a few tips. So um, grab your pens and papers and then let's, let's get into it. So the first thing that you need to, to, to consider before even putting in your money um, into the into the business you must make sure that uh, you have your market uh, you must make sure that you have people to sell either your broilers or your your your, your, your chicken to uh, so you need to make sure that you do your market research so that at the end of the cycle or, or at the end of each product each production um, you don't lose money trying to to, to find a uh, market so you must make sure that uh, you have your market you have uh, people to sell to it can be either other businesses it can be your chisanyamas it can be your supermarkets um, and other uh, and other markets that i did not mention but you must make sure that your market is on point so the the second thing that you need to consider is feed so usually feed will take about 70 percent of your capital um, so if you have 10,000 to start uh, the business, 70% of that or even more in some cases if you don't know uh, what you are doing will go into feed. So you need to make sure that your feed is, 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 is in place. Uh, you must make sure that most of your capital uh, will go into feed. So there are two companies that you, you, you must buy your feed from. So the first one is Epol and the second one is Itau. So those are the two companies that sell the best feed in the country. So you must make sure that you, yeah, you, 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 you consult them or you go into their website um, to, know, uh, to get to know how to buy the, their food. But in most cases, uh, in most cases, for example, um, Ipol, they don't allow individuals to come and buy their feed directly from them unless you are buying a minimum of 200 bags. That's when they will allow you to to buy um, uh, to buy directly from them. Otherwise, you can buy from their dis distributors like PKP and other and other and other companies. Um, so the, the the other thing that you must check or you must consider is the, is the, is, the, is the security of the place where you're growing your chickens. So you must make sure that the place in which you are growing the chickens is um, is secured and also. It, it must be comfortable for the chicks because these things they are very fragile so you must make sure that all your bedding all your lights all your if you're growing them in winter you must make sure that your your, your heaters they are they, they, they are they, they are working properly so that um, you don't end up losing your your your, your, your chickens Um, so with regards to feed or your feeding, you need to make sure that um, you give them there are three uh, types of feed that you need to give to your chickens from day one up to, uh, to, to slaughtering. So the first feed that you give them is your starter, is your starter feed. And, and then from day uh, 15 to day 24, you give them your, 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 your growing mesh. And then from day 24 up to a slaughtering uh, age, you give them your, 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 your finisher. So I will make an example um, how much feed that you need to get for your, for your broilers. For, so for every 100 bags that you buy, you need to have at least eight bags of feed. So you'll have your three bags of, of, of starter, and also you have, you, you'll have your four bags of growing mesh, and then you'll have one or two bags of your finisher. So another thing that you need uh, to make sure that it's there in the chicken house, you need to make sure that your your drinkers, uh, your feeding equipment, and also your drinking your drinking equip, uh, your, uh, equipment is there in the chicken house. That is your drinkers and also your feeders. You can get all this material, all your drinking equipment, and also your feeding um, uh, equipment from a company called Poltech. They are one of the best suppliers when it comes to um, your poultry your poultry equipment. 
uh, which is your fitting equipment and also your drinking equipment and also they do sell uh, heaters uh, f f for your protein and also they do sell uh, chicken scales if you want to measure the weight of your chickens another thing that is important as you venture into this business is your record keeping so you need to make sure that you record everything that is happening in, in the farm you need to record your mortality rate which if you want to be a good farmer your mortality rate must always be less than must must always be less than five percent it's either five percent or less than five percent if it goes up to 10 to, to 10 11 percent then you must know that there's something wrong that you are doing in your farm so you need to make sure that your goal um, in each growing cycle is to keep your meta your mortality rate uh, less than percent less than five percent sorry um, another thing that you that must be there um, in your record keeping is your vaccination uh, or vaccine program in most cases uh, you will buy you will buy uh, one day chicks that are already vaccinated uh, so you need to make sure that you push for that uh, your supplier must it is the supplier's duty to make sure that the chickens are vaccinated against um, all uh, diseases and viruses such as uh, your Newcastle diseases, your, your, your bird flu. Um, so you need to make sure that um, your chickens are vaccinated from, from the supplier. But if you do give them some, medi some medi uh, medication, you need to keep note of the medication so that if anything goes wrong or if anything uh, goes right, you know, you know uh, which medicine and vaccines you used um, in your farm. So that is all for today um, and thank you very much for, 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 for watching this video. If you haven't subscribed uh, to our YouTube channel, please subscribe um, and hit the notification uh, button so that you can get a notification of uh, future videos. Um, sure.